Now for a special treat and a brand new piece of music. The Idlewild Arts Academy is about to celebrate its 70th year, and in honor of that, the school has commissioned a work from composer Maria Newman. Maria Newman is an Annenberg Foundation Composition Fellow, a Mary Pickford Foundation Composition Fellow, and the Malibu Coast Chamber Orchestra's Composer-in-Residence. She's also a violin and viola soloist. Please welcome her. Maria, thanks for being with us. Newman is a familiar name, not only from the Seinfeld show. Um, (laughs) I have to mention that you are a member of the Newman family film music dynasty. Would you introduce the piece we're going to hear and maybe tell us a little bit about the background of the piece? Absolutely. So let me just say that this place is very special to me. I spent many summers here uh, at Idlewild Arts Academy, then called Isomata, uh, and I really developed my absolute love of classical music from this place. And at that time, it was all outdoors. So Septuaginta, which is the name of my piece, is in reference to the 70 years that this incredible place has been in existence, inspiring so many people. And what the piece is based on inside of the fact that it's about the 70-year anniversary is the idea that here in Idlewild, we are one with nature. We're outside with trees and flowers. And so I have taken some Emily Dickinson poems and set them with a, an instrumental work that will deal with bees. It's quite a celebratory piece, and uh, we're looking forward to hearing this. To play this piece, we have eight teenage string players, our violinists are Derek Shu, Eric Wang, Lilia Milcheva, and Angelina Jeleva. Our violists are Jason Lan and Jenny Sung, and our cellists are Hua Huang and Richard Liu. This is Maria Newman's Septuaginta in Praise of Nature.
Huge string octet made up of students here at the Idlewild Arts Academy played the final movement in praise of nature from Maria Newman's Septuaginta. They were coached by Heather Metz and the composer herself. I want to thank Maria for that celebratory music and for her elegant introduction of it.